All right, guys. Today's video, we're gonna be doing something very different. It's way different from fishing. It's actually the complete opposite. We are gonna be sighting in my gun here. It's a little 1.77 caliber break barrel pellet gun. We're gonna be sighting that in for you. I already have a video of this on my channel, but that that was before I really knew what I was doing. So I figured I'm gonna do it again because a lot of people don't know how to properly sight in a gun. Well, this one is just the default scope that it comes with, but you can do you can get different scopes but it's basically the same thing so we're gonna sight this in get a good spot to shoot it and then we're gonna start we're gonna start shooting them give you guys a little closer view of this gun this is the gamma silent cat the first one but i have right next to me the newer generation but i'm just gonna go through this one this one has it's pretty quiet but i mean once you use it a little bit it really it really like the spring or something like I'm not really too familiar with this stuff and I'm not really the best shot so be prepared for that but I do know how to sight in the scope so I'm gonna do it on this one and then I'm also gonna do it on this one it's pretty simple but well it's kind of hard but once you know it it's simple is basically what I'm trying to say this one is also I think this is like 1500 FPS what did it say oh no it's for 1420 FPS and then this one's like 1250 I think uh, yeah. yeah, 1250 FPS, so a little more power on this side, but really not that much different. Alright, so we got our pellets right here, switching up, going the head cam this time. I figured the chest is just not going to see anything. So we load it up, pull it back, got our safety on. So first, we're just going to take a few shots and see where we're at. So I'm going to aim right at that deer's head, the deer all the way to the right. All right, let's take safety on, pull it back. Let's take about about five shots and just see where we're at. We got our shots. Safety's on, let's we'll break the barrel for first shot. Oh, you're shooting at that? Yeah. All right, so I can already tell a little bit. I'm gonna go down there and show you, but I am way right. Like, it's gonna be like probably about 10 clicks right. As you can really see how far off I was. I was aiming right at that deer's head. I was all the way over here so that's gonna be quite a few look I took five shots there's four on there I mean that groupings not terrible but it's not great but it's a start but you can see some of them even missed I took about five shots and there's four so I'm definitely gonna have to go a lot of clicks right probably or no left yeah left all right so I'm gonna go do those clicks now all right took a few shots safety's on Grill's broken. Will it cave on? Take a shot. I think you hit it that time. He's aiming at that little whatever that is cotton candy container. All right, I'm gonna go see where I hit now. See where we hit. Ah, we're low actually. We're low. We got so we had the four here. So we still need to go over. We're right here, right here. We're all over here. So we're gonna definitely need to go right a lot more a lot more clicks my gun's kind of weird so I, I do need to go a lot more clicks than really am i'm only about like 20 yards away i'm not really that far probably looks farther than gopro but i i'm down so i need to go up I need to go up a few clicks and over left a few clicks then i should be right on did you hit yours yeah twice where all right he hit his Here. low in here and then there that's so yeah at least he's he's sighted on but my, i haven't shot my gun and it feels like a year it's probably been pretty close up a little bit just a little bit up and then we're gonna go left a whole bunch we can always go too far left and we can always bring it back but i'm gonna do about half half a click something might be wrong with my scope because i do remember in the past having a little bit of troubles with my scope but we're gonna take another five shots and just see where we see where we are. And that car made me jump. Come on. All right, whatever. That was the five shots. So now we're gonna head on down there and we're gonna see if we actually got closer. Let's see. Oh yeah, we're closer. We're closer. We're right here. We got two here two here but as you can see the groupings are starting to get a little bit better than they usually are so we're starting to crawl our way over to his head we're pretty good on height right now so we don't need to go up any we just need to go left 
a whole bunch, but that's that's progress from over here. All right, we're gonna go shoot about, probably about four more. Just come back and see if I'm any closer. My goal is to get him in the head. Whoa, and just like that, we switched angles. I'm gonna be, I put the head mount down this time and I'm gonna be trying to clip it right here. It should fit, but I'm just gonna be trying a few different angles today, this little experiment. It should be pretty good if I bring it back a little bit, just like that. All right, here we go. We're gonna try this angle. Got it. Got our pellets right here, loading them up. Could you do me a favor and see if I'm actually even in the frame? You can go behind there and this should, the screen should be on. All right, if I'm like this, can you see me? Yeah. All right, is it like good in the middle? Yeah. It should be. All right, so we're gonna take our first shot of this head. See if, oh no, I forgot to make my adjustments. Duh. <laughs> All right, so let's go, we gotta go left a lot more. Let's do ha about half a turn, half a turn left. All right, here we go. First shot. All right. First shot complete. Get another bullet. Put her in. Let's go. All right, so let's head on down there. Go see if I'm any closer. I could actually see through my scope a little bit. I see one. It's closer, so we're getting there. All right, yeah. Here are my four or five shots or whatever I took. I got no those two were there. That one's that one's closer. I took these two. I probably took about what three shots? They're probably all right there. Those are probably the three shots I took. So we're getting there, we're getting closer. But targets right there. I at least on his neck, so I can know to aim up a little bit instead of like having to like worry about left and right. I know if I shoot like right here, I'd hit that deer right in the head. But I want to be able to, I'm aiming like right in the middle of his head, like right there. And I'm going all over here. So we need, we still need to go left a whole bunch. And I think we're pretty good with straight up and down. I don't need to mark him. Where are you shooting? He's like spot on. I don't know. I'm shooting it's there. Not fair. I was. He's got like right there. I was aiming there and I got, got there, there and it went right through to the other side. Yeah. So he's, he's. At least he's got a confined a con confined spot that he's at least getting close to. I'm over here shooting like a mile away from the deer. <laughs> All right, so now we're gonna go back up and we're gonna hopefully. So now I'm gonna make my adjustments. I still need to go quite a bit left. So I'm gonna do about, I don't know, that's probably like 75% of a turn. Can always go right, so. Let's put that bullet in. Let's take another three or four shots. We're gonna see if we're any closer. Getting closer and closer. Look at that grouping right there. We just need to go a lot more left. That is a solid grouping. That's kind of the grouping you wanna see when you're down here. But we're slowly, slowly getting closer to this deer. All right, did you hit? Um, let's see. No, I don't think, I think you might have missed. Oh no, right down here, you got like three shots right here. You got four. One, two, three, four. These two were Camera's here. really not picking it up, but. Oh yeah, you got, you got like these, five on here. You're doing good. These were here. That you just need there. to go left, and you need to keep your hands sturdy a little bit, because these are yeah, I think this like one's a perfect new. line up. Yeah, I think this <laughs> Look one's at this. New. You shot it behind there, and like the cotton candy <laughs> followed the bullet. <laughs> Jeez. All right, we're going to go take some more shots. I was looking at this box right here. I was like, what the heck is this? These are my bullets. They're like bouncing and they're going like crawling up this box and going straight up. That is so cool. I didn't know that they would do that. There must be something hard in there. Oh yeah, it's that thing down there. You guys can't really see that, but there's like a hard piece of cardboard right there and they're bouncing off that and just coming straight up. <laughs> gonna make these adjustments. We got the up and down one right here. Not sure how well the GoPro is gonna pick that up, but we're just gonna go up like probably about 15 clicks and just we can always come back down so I'm gonna take four shots and see how much of a difference this made I know it's gonna make a lot of a difference but I that one shot was like right in his head that's probably not even focusing not focusing but like that one I probably shot too fast as well but we're gonna head on down there and see how see if that made a big difference it should have here we go let's see if we're 
getting anywhere. Let's see, we got two in the nose. We're coming up a little bit, guys. Coming up. So I was down here in this area, but now I'm, I'm up here a little bit. Got that one. I still have that perfect shot. But I'm coming up, so I just need to come up a few more clicks, and then I should be right in the middle. I'm just, I'm not going to show me getting it. I'm just going to shoot, and I'm going to get it all sighted in, and then I'll come back down here and show you. Got done shooting about, oh yeah, there we go. There's the grouping we want. There we go. We got it all sighted in now. We got about five. All the, those are all shots I just took. We got that one, that one, that one, and that one. There we go. We're all sighted in now. So now we're going to shoot at some stuff and have some fun. All right, guys. So we got this good idea. So we got the soda and we got the GoPro in the waterproof case. We're going to put this GoPro so close to the soda and we're going to sit, we're going to shake it up, shake it up a whole bunch. And then we're gonna shoot this thing, it's gonna explode. All right, let's head on down. Out of the way, we got this perfect little area right here. Still shaking up, I wanna shoot this thing and it's gonna, ex this thing's gonna explode. That's why I keep all my waterproof cases. I also have the frame and stuff, but I mean, oh yeah, look at this, show this. Look at all the pellets that we're hitting, like look at this flat pellet. Thing's so flat, is it out of focus? No, I guess that's pretty in focus. Well, that thing is so flat, it's from hitting these bricks. All right, so we got the soda right here. Let's show the Pepsi, Pepsi sign. Now where are we gonna put this GoPro? That's not gonna fit right there. We're probably gonna have to get a little stick or something to put right there, or I don't know. We'll, we'll figure it out and we'll get back to you once we figure it out. All right, so we're gonna head up there. We're gonna take the shot. All right, guys, here we go. Three, two, one. Oh, oh my gosh, that thing just exploded. <laughs> oh my gosh, let's go check on my GoPro. That thing probably got soaked. It's gonna be all sticky now. I didn't even think of that. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, guys, this is everywhere. Look at this, look at the can. Oh my gosh, just like exploded. You can see where it came out. Look at that. The only way I like my Pepsi. coming out of a bullet hole look at that oh my gosh this thing just like oh it, the blunt of the force just went all at my GoPro oh my gosh oh this thing is all sticky now all right we got to wash this guy off that was awesome thanks so much for watching if you're new to my channel you're gonna want to subscribe because we got a ton of amazing content coming up and you're not gonna want to miss it so thanks so much for watching oh yeah let me know how you guys like these more like gun type videos down in the comments because we can definitely do more of these all right so thanks so much for watching see ya